signs. Welcome to to our readings by Roxby. So I am going to do your daily reading a little different today. And this is exactly how I want to do it on Facebook too. When I get enough people in the chat, because I want to do it live, the dailies, just like this. But I need you guys to like my page. So the link will be below in the, um, right below the video in the description box. So this is going to be for Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. So I am going to use the Modern Spellcasters. We're going to get a card from here. And I was feeling bad too. I've been missing Facebook. Um, I just, I don't know. I have a cold. And I'm not liking it. But I feel a little bit better now. Thank God. Okay, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, in that order. Let me make sure. These cards are very slippery. I just want to make sure I didn't drop. Oh, yep, see, there was one. I had it. I knew it. Like, those of you that don't know, like, I'm highly intuitive. Like, I just knew. I knew that there was a card missing. It's crazy. Okay. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Perfect. You're each getting your own element today. Your own reading for your own element, I should say. cards are so so slippery okay Virgo ten of Pentacles in the reverse these are um the modern spellcasters tarot Taurus strength beautiful in this deck right Capricorn, Eight of Swords in the reverse. Okay. So, Virgo. Some of you could be dealing with another Earth sign. Um, or this could be, you know, this will be your energy. For some of you, this will be experiencing some sort of financial drain. This could be family business that's not doing so well. There could be trouble within the family. You know, on the home front, over finances. For the majority of you, I do feel like there is just some sort of financial drain. Taurus, some of you could be... I'm going to clarify too. Some of you could be dealing with the Leo... Um, if not, then, you know, some of you are just finding that strength, courage to move forward. You know, for some of you, this is that finding that strength and, you know, courage to control your temper. It's dealing with any difficult situations that may arise in a, in a very calm way. You know, it's also about having patience. You know, in this card, you know, look at the mountains. You know, there's blocks, there's obstacles. Patience is definitely required. And guys, you know, especially major arcana cards, th these energies, all of them really, you know, could play out over the next couple of days. And then um, Capricorn. Eight of Swords reversed. You know, some of you could be dealing with an air sign, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. For others, this will be your energy. Some of you were feeling trapped and restricted. You know, this you were you were feeling this way. You know, too much in the mind. You know, but you're coming out of that. 
coming out of that energy. You're, you're, you're coming out of that mental prison. You're not allowing yourself to be trapped by your thoughts anymore. Yeah. Um, all right. So I'm going to use um, the Gilded Reverie Lenormans to clarify. Um, love these cards. They're amazing. Okay. Virgo. Okay. Virgo. Taurus. Okay, we have the anchor with the Ten of Pentacles. So, some of you, I feel like someone is trying to, you know, hold you down, drag you down into a situation regarding your job, maybe your career. I feel like, I definitely feel like whatever it is, you know, that someone is trying to lock you in. You know, there's some sort of financial drain for you guys. Um, and just, you know, being pulled down, you know, could be within your job, your home, your family. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Taurus, we have the sun. So you're definitely, definitely some of you are dealing with a Leo. Some of my Tauruses are definitely dealing with a Leo. Others of you, I feel like you know, something has been illuminated. Finding. Something that you did not know before is coming to light. And I do feel like you're being very strong and successful at dealing with this particular situation. You're keeping your temper in check. You're staying patient. Definitely, you're feeling great. And I do feel like you have the strength and the courage to move forward in terms of the situation. You know, whether it's your job, career, dealing with a certain person. I like it. Beautiful. Capricorn. We have the tree. This is family. So. Your thoughts about family matters. It could have. You know. Felt like. Could have felt that a family situation was worse than what it really was. What it really is. You know, so I just think some of you were just overthinking a family situation. But I feel like now, you know, you're going to be able to move forward regarding this situation. And I feel like you're at the beginning of a healing process as well. 
I do feel strongly this is more related to family than anything else. Yeah. <coughs> so sorry, guys. I'm still a uh, cold thing, but I do feel much better today. Okay, these are Oracle of the Mermaids advice. are huge. They really are like so hard to shuffle. Taurus 15th November 2017. Advice for Taurus. Receptivity, allow yourself to receive, allow yourself to give. These cards are beautiful. Um, I feel like with this card, you know, you need to allow yourself to be more open, giving to others. Be more open and allowing yourself to receive from others. And if you notice here in the card too, you know, the bird is bringing this woman something. Um, and I do feel for some of you there could be communication coming your way you, know, you, you might need to allow yourself to receive something or you might need to give communication but I feel like whatever situation you're dealing with you're just going to be very calm and patient you know and just let it resolve itself whatever it is I do feel there's going to be a lot of, of success in whatever this is, though. Definitely. Time and Tide. Um... Says at the bottom, organic spells and rituals. You know, I, f I do feel like it's about, you know, taking that time for yourself. Could be holding on to some sort of emotional upset, maybe. Some sort of upheaval of emotion. I really do feel like, you know, you, you do need to, and I feel like you are. You're, you're All these blocks, whatever it is, you know, I mean, the sun is shining here. You know, the light's coming through. It's coming through here. You know, and, and and you have the sun, so I think you just need to just stay patient and really just let it come to you.
and freedom. Well, you just feel free, literally, from, you know, family, from, you know, the emotions that you're going through. You're, you're just, you know, again, you know, for a lot of you, I mean, the clarity that's coming through today for you guys is amazing. It's independence, self-determination. You know, like it's it's you feeling fiery, passionate, ambitious. Um, just courage, determination. You're wanting to find that independence, that freedom, you know, maybe from the family or whatever it is, but I feel like you do need to gain some confidence, which you are, I feel like you are starting to, but a little more is required. It's just, you know, regaining confidence, courage, determination to move forward independently in some, in some way. For others, you know, it could be your personal truth. But I, I do feel like you know, whatever you've been waiting on for a long time. It is coming in for you. All right, Capricorn. Very nice. All right, guys. I hope you liked it this way. Um, gonna, this is how I really kind of want to do it on Facebook Live. But I want enough people in the chat. And, you know, there's a better chance of me um, connecting with you with the readings on Facebook. Um, definitely. You know? And I am anxious to start doing that. So, guys, please like my Facebook page. All right, guys, um, this is great. Nice reading. Have a beautiful day, and I will see you guys back here soon. Love you guys. Bye-bye.